Hello my dear friends, my name is Sonne and I'm back with another beauty video and today we're gonna have a very very relaxed kind of video and we're just gonna do a simple get ready with me because I have my first concert since the start of Covid tonight and I want to get ready, I want to do makeup inspired by the band and I want to look cool as hell have a cool outfit and everything so i'm just gonna get ready for the concert show you my makeup and my hair and my outfit and everything and just have a grand old time i just i just want to relax do my makeup a bit you know so let's get into it and i'll tell you a bit about the concert while i get ready i just plop on my favorite little headbands so, I'm going to the Royal Blood concert in Amsterdam with my boyfriend. Very excited about it. I think we bought these tickets like somewhere last year. So it isn't one of those concerts that has been postponed because of COVID. So, yay. And we're very lucky because today, like the day of the concert, is like actually the day our entire country opens up again. Like it has been open like decently for like the past few weeks um almost anything was allowed um there were just some regulations on indoors events that didn't have seating and then you had to get tested before that um so that would have been this concert but since today they're lifting that rule we don't really have to have proof of testing before we go there so that's great because uh I don't have to go out to a testing center to get that done but we are gonna do a self-test like before we go i don't know where i would possibly have contracted corona because i don't go anywhere um this is like the first thing that i'm doing in a long while i'm sorry i'm so pale by the way the lighting is like the lighting is great because outside it's just absolutely freaking delicious weather but it's a bit very light in here let me just see if i can close the curtains a bit if that helps that's good okay we can continue but yeah this is like the first real thing i'm doing besides from like one or two birthday parties a little while ago which were like tops 10 people but um yeah i'm excited i'm also nervous because i haven't been among people in a while and it's gonna be very weird to be like up close and personal <laughs> with a lot of strangers in one big room so i don't know maybe i'm gonna get overstimulated and i'm gonna cry but we'll see if that happens but yeah i'm very excited and i wanted to do like something creative of course because it's like the first time i'm going out for something so i want to do creative makeup for that wear something fun so what i had in mind is a look inspired by their newest album cover like their newest royal blood album cover i prefer their older covers like especially their first album cover it was so good it's such great artwork i absolutely love that album cover but um it's boring it's just <laughs> black and white but also too detailed to take those black and white details into a makeup look so the undercover is also black and white not really something i can do on my face so the final cover is left and that one has a bit of color so i thought it would be fun to do something with that it features pink and like a teal color uh which are two of my favorite shades so you know i'm very happy to do a makeup look using those two colors and i have a very fun idea in mind i think like i think it's gonna turn out fun and also like the weather today makes me so happy like the the weather is literally delicious like it's such there is not a cloud in the sky. The sky seems almost white because of how bright the sun is. It's warm. Like it was almost too warm to wear this vest out. Like I had my little raincoat on top of that, my yellow coat, um, to walk to the grocery store for like three minutes and I was sweating. It's just really good weather. And it makes me really happy because it hasn't been that great of weather recently. Like just the last two weeks, it has been absolutely lovely. And it's really making me feel a lot better. And there are flowers everywhere and little birds and, and animals. I saw a few deer last week. Like, this is good. This is good for me. 
this <laughs> this is literally making me feel good. This weekend I was able to wear my new dress for the first time, like my new sunny summer dress. Makes me happy. I'm gonna try and list everything that I used down below in the description so you can check it there if you want. But yeah, I'm, re I'm really, really excited for this concert. And I have seen Royal Blood live before once, like after their second album they did a European tour and I went and saw that concert which was really interesting. I don't know how old I was, I think I was like 18. Like I just turned 18 maybe. Back then I used to want to stand in front because I want to stand as, as close as possible to the to band, you know, like any great fangirl would. But um, I also absolutely hate mosh pits and such because I'm a small bean, like I'm not small, I'm a regular height for a Dutch woman, but I'm a small bean. I don't like getting close to people, I don't like it when people bump into me, I don't... I feel like I'm gonna die if I enter a mosh pit, you know? I'm not an aggressive person at all, I have never fought anyone in my entire life. Mosh pits aren't my favorite thing, so... Um, <laughs> like the last few years, like before Covid of course, we always, my boyfriend and I, when we go to concert, we also always stand on the balcony and then on the front of the balcony, so you get as close as possible to the band, but you also have great view. But yeah, last time we saw them live was really interesting. Because there's like a pretty wild mosh pit going on. Um, two. We were approximately in the center of the room, near the front, like, there were like two or three people, no, maybe more. Four or five people in front of us. There and there, on both sides, like right behind us, were mosh pits. And we were with the four of us, um, my boyfriend, me, and two of my friends. And they are like <laughs> a lot smaller than me even. You know, people were moshing behind us, pushing against us. And my boyfriend was just standing behind us, having his arms around us the entire time. All three of us just keeping people out of there. And then suddenly, like, there was, like, ugh, it was really gross. I don't know what I'm telling you this. Um, if you're, like, eating, maybe stop or skip this part. Because <laughs> it's gross. Somewhere behind us, suddenly, there was, like, a bit of an opening. And we didn't know why. Um, it was because someone was throwing up, you know, in the middle of the mosh pit. And everyone was, like, <laughs> staying away from it. Um, so we tried to move away a tiny bit. Uh, and then suddenly we didn't have to move away because um, the mosh pit was taking over again and people were pushing each other on the floor, you know, rolling through the vomit and such. And it was approximately the grossest thing I've ever seen in real life. So yeah, I'm really hoping that isn't the case tonight, but I think we'll just stand in the back of the back of the room a bit. <laughs> I'm not gonna stand anywhere near the front again. Like, I do like watching Morsh bits, they're fun, but I don't wanna be caught in one. Okay, so this is the album cover that I wanna do something with. As you can see, it's very, like, glitchy, um, and it's, like, a light peachy pink with teal, so... I'm gonna try and see if I have colors that match that one perfectly. I'm just gonna grab my Beauty Bay Bright Matte palette because I feel like that's the best way to go about it. And I think I'm just gonna go for these two, um, Sea Mist and Dragon Fruit. So I'm gonna grab a fluffy brush, gonna start with Sea Mist in the outer corner. I think I dabbed on way too much on my brush, but that's fine. Um, we have some eye primer going on. I'm really sorry about that gross story just now, by the way. <laughs> it was like absolutely gross, but like that stays with you. That's a memory. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever forget about that. I don't know if you can hear that, but someone outside is like blasting, blasting on full volume a happy birthday song. Anyway, I'm just blending this into a bit of a wing. And then I'm going in with the shade next to it, Daydream, which is a lighter shade. I'm sorry, people are making so much noise outside. I'm just blending those edges with the lighter shade. And then going into Dragon Fruit, then going in with the lighter shade. I think I'm going into Sweet Tooth. I don't really mind if it looks like messy because if we're gonna be like jumping over there and 
you know, it, it's gonna look messy anyway. Now let's get into shimmers and I'm going into Crab House from Chaos Dirt, which is like such a gorgeous shimmer, oh my god. Like, won't you look at that? And then I'm getting into this one, which is Frosty the Flamingo, also by Chaos Dirt. Let's put that over there. And now we have this bit like bubblegum moment going on. Okay, and then I go into Scheduled Specs and apply that to the inner corner. Of course, if we're doing pink, we gotta do scheduled specs in the inner corner. Okay, and now the eyeshadow portion is done. So now I'm gonna get into the eyeliner. And for that, I'm using my Grimas water-based face paints. And for the first shade, I'm going into this one, um, which is like a teal. I'm just spraying my setting spray in there. And I'm gonna start from like approximately the inner corner, then going above the crease or like a fun simple graphic liner shape and as you can see it kind of blends into the makeup over here and that's what i'm going for i don't want it to be too thick of a line but i am going for it being visible you know okay that's the blue eyeliner down and now i'm gonna go into this bright pink and this one i'm gonna start from like over here because I want to go from the same corner but go more up so that point of the wing is higher you just want to make that like a fun little creative matching liner moment I went a tiny bit wrong on this side like I went a bit too low so it's transferring but that's fine okay fun and then when those liners have dried I'm going in with black eyeliner and I'm just gonna do a normal eyeliner wing like that just a subtle Wing moment. Oh, this is fun. Okay, like that. Fun. It's looking. This is looking all sorts of fun. I'm really enjoying this. Like it does look a bit messy and rushed, but besides that, it just looks fun, especially from a distance. I'm just gonna go back into scheduled specs, the one that I used in my inner corner, and I'm just gonna apply a tiny bit of that as a brow bone highlight. I'm just gonna use a black eye pencil to kind of deepen up where I applied the eyeliner. Just so it looks a bit more closed off. I've been so focused on this eyeliner thing that I haven't spoken about anything in the last 20 minutes, I think. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> it's looking cute, so such a fun could get ready with me, right? So I think now it's time to like round it off very easily. So I'm using Candlelit Glow from the Essence Choose Your Glow palette for a bit more of a cool toned highlighter. And then to round it off, I'm going in with my black lipstick from Lethal Cosmetics. This is the Chimera liquid lipstick in the shade Abyss. And I'm gonna be real focused while applying this because of course it's black and it's gonna, you know, um, show if you don't apply it well. Because that's like really, really freaking black. I just love black lipstick. I'm sorry. I mean, I just feel so good in black lipstick. It just looks nice. I'm just gonna get into some of my new eyeliners. Uh, because they have the perfect colors. And I'm just gonna line my waterline with these. So my eyeshadow blends into my waterline, you know. And then we have these, this teal color for the outside. I'm just gonna do some lashes and mascara real quick and then I'm gonna show you what outfit I'm gonna wear or at least I'm gonna pick an outfit because I gotta pick something. Okay, here's the full look. I also did my hair a tiny bit, like I just curled uh, the front bits a bit with a straightener, that's it, just to get some texture in the front. I feel really cute. Let's get into the outfit because I'm a bit in doubt on what I should wear. Let me zoom you out so I can show you what I got. Okay, so I am just gonna wear my black Dr. Martens. Um, it is warm, so I'm just gonna wear a t-shirt. And um, I'm just a bit in doubt on which t-shirt and which pants I'm gonna wear with it. Because I have two t-shirts. They're both like two t-shirts that are the option for today. They're both band shirts. One of them is like my actual merch like my Alter Bridge merch. This was for my first concert in 2016. 
It's a long time ago. Usually when I go to concerts, I wear this one because it's my absolute favorite. So I have this option, which like the red has faded a bit, so it does look a bit pink. So I could wear it with this eye look. Uh, but I also have this t-shirt, which is just a basic ACDC shirt that I got at the CNA. Like color wise, this might fit a bit better with the blue. Yeah, I have those two t-shirt options and then for jeans i have these just black mom jeans with flames on the booty i think these are from shein i got them second hand and then i also have my black and white go-go -go pants these are like flared pants i absolutely freaking love these they just like my butt looks great in them and then they're just flared at the bottom and they look really cool and i feel like um if I'm gonna wear these pants, I wanna wear the ACDC top on top and crop it a bit, like just tied up. And if I'm gonna wear the other pants, I wanna wear my Ultra Rich t-shirt. So I think I'm just gonna try on those combinations and then show you and then I'll decide. Be right back. Okay, 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 okay. I picked the outfit. I'm going for this, my Ultra Rich t-shirt and my funky pants with my Dr. Martens. I'm not really gonna do much more. I think I'm just gonna wear my daily necklace and maybe put in some fun earrings but I don't really want to add too much jewelry because you're gonna be close to other people and I don't want to like get stuck in other people's hair or whatever. This is the outfit and this is makeup of course. So yeah this is gonna be it for today. The lighting is really weird I'm sorry. So this is gonna be it for today. Um, I'm gonna go to my concert. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more from me. If you want to see even more from me, my blog and my socials and everything else you need to know about me, like my gaming channel, are all linked down below so you can check that out as well. And that's gonna be it for me today. I wanna thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Toodles!